Welcome to the World Wide Wave Broadcast. I'm Brandon Froner, your anchor. We're going to be talking about waves and how they form, travel, etc. We're now going to send you to Spencer Burt for some facts about waves. Hi, I'm Spencer, and here behind me is a picture of a wave. When you first hear waves, you think of water, but we mean a disturbance. Up at the top of this picture, you see a point called the crust, and down at the bottom is the trough. To learn how to measure a wave, here is Isaac. Frequency is how many times a wave passes through a certain point per minute. You can measure a wave's frequency by choosing a point and see how many crusts or troughs it passes. Amplitude is how far above and below a wave is from the middle of a wave. And wavelength is the distance from one crest to another, or one throw to another. Some of the key terms you need to know is reflection, refraction, diffraction, and interference. Refra reflection is the bouncing back of a wave after it strikes a barrier. Refraction, bending of a wave as it enters a new medium. Diffraction is the spreading out of waves through a, a, the medium of an option, object. Interference is the combing of waves. And thank you. And now do we go to... FRONA! There are two types of interferences, constructive and destructive. Constructive is the combining of two waves, then crest to crest or tro to tro. Destructive interference is when waves combine and make a smaller wave, crest to tro. That's the difference between constructive and destructive interferences. Thank you for watching the Wave Broadcast. Our two resources for this project were Wikipedia and Fish's Classroom.